Here's a video to show you how to use the force sensor. It's actually a pretty easy sensor to use. Let's start by testing it out. Let's wrap the sensor in a while loop, so we'll just keep testing it over and over. We grab the read sensor, and Hitechnic doesn't have a VI for this. So we're just going to use the read light sensor with the LED turned off. This works because the force sensor is just an analog sensor like the light sensor. Alright, now let's take the value returned from the sensor and display it to the screen. That way then we can test out some weights and forces with it and see what values are returned. I always like to throw a weight block in my while loop so that the loop isn't just running over and over without a break and we want the loop to run forever. Alright, so there's the sensor, has an axle in it, and we push on this, the axle. Here's a test. Here's a light ring. It returns about a value of about 20, 22. You see that when I remove it, it returns to zero. I put in a heavy ring, value about 39, 40. Let's try that light ring again. Get a value about 14 this time. There will be some variation. All right, so let's make this program a little bit better. So let's have the program light up some lights to indicate whether or not we have a heavy ring. So we're going to test the value, and I want to test it against a number in between the light one and the heavy one. So, you know, halfway between 20 and 40 is about 30. Now I need a case statement to deal with when it's below 30 and when it's above 30. So if it's less than 30, and that's true, then it means there's no heavy ring. If it's false, if it's greater than 30, then we know there is a heavy ring and we want to do something different. I'm going to turn on the lamps to indicate to the user that they have a heavy ring or not. On my little demonstration robot, I have a green light and a red light. So if there's no ring, the red light will be on, the green light will be off. All right, I'm just going to copy this code because it's pretty much the same for false. Paste it. And I'll switch the ports so that the green light will be on if there's a heavy ring and the red light will be off. All right, let's test it out. All right, so there was a red light. This is not a heavy ring. And now the green light comes on. This is a heavy ring. Light ring again. Doesn't turn the green light on.